Hi everyone, Craig Budd here, Application Scientist at SciX. Today we're gonna to talk about how the integration of ChemSpider within SciXOS can power up your unknown compound identification during non-target screening. So here I've got a great example. Uh, you can see down below, I've got a nice strong intense peak and a good NSMS uh, fragmentation pattern. However, um, there has been no library match, so I'm not sure what the structure is. So how can we interrogate this data a little bit further and maybe try to um, propose some potential structures? Well, through my uh, formula finder, I can access our ChemSpider portal here, uh, which opens up the window, and I'll just blow this up a little bit further. Um, you can see we have a number of potential structures uh, from the ChemSpider database. And then here we have a match between our experimental MSMS and the theoretical fragmentation pattern from ChemSpider. Um, you can see here the blue means we have good matches. In fact, we can look at some of those fragments such as here, and we can see where on the molecule the fragment has theoretically formed. So there you have it, folks, um, how the integration of ChemSpider within SciXOS can power up your unknown identification. If you'd like more information or a demo of what I just showed you, please click on the link below. Bye for now.